What is going on YouTube? My name is Keith the Tagaru, and in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how you guys can optimize your computer so it can run at its best performance. And not too many people know about this, so that's why in this video I will teach you. So what you need to do, head over to Start, Settings, System, Notification and Actions. Make sure all these are off. And to turn off these below, click this one, last one, and then just turn them off. After that, go down to Focus Assist. Turn that, turn the first option to off. Make sure all these are off. And you head over, head over down to Tablet Mode. When I sign in, you use Desktop Mode. Just go to that one. And the second one, when this device automatically switches Tablet Mode on and off, don't ask me again and don't switch. And turn off these switches. Then head over to Remote Desktop. See, if your desktop don't support remote desktop, then that's fine. You can just leave it. But if it does, then you can turn it off if you want. Head, head over to personalization. And here, this, this part don't really matter. But if you want that extra performance, you can all, always change the solid color. Even though personally, like, it doesn't really matter. So you can just keep it to pictures or whatever. Okay, but now, I'm going to go to home. Gaming. Now here's a part where like most people might use this for like Xbox or they love using the Microsoft capture programs. So but if you don't want to use them at all or you never or you never use them, you can just turn them off like right here, just turn it off. Head over to cap capture. See so my computer don't support capture, but if your computer does, you can just turn it off and you'll be good to go. Head over to the game mode. Now you now keep this mode on because when you're playing games on your computer, your Windows will automatically optimize your computer so when the game that you're playing will run at, or like will run at its best performance. And th this last one, you don't really need to do anything about this. And yeah, let's go go back to home. Privacy. General. Make sure all these are off. All these are off. Head over to diagnostics and feedback. Now you want to change this one from full to basic. Scroll down, turn all these off. Then once all these are off, oh yeah, and make sure feedback frequency is never. And after all that is done, just hit delete. And when you get this, you're all good to go. Now head over to location. Make sure all these are off. And then you can clear. And wait for the check mark and then you're good to go. Camera, same thing, you can turn all of them off. And yeah, that's all set that's all you need to do in the settings. So now you want to right click the Windows logo, go to system, then head head over to system info, go to advanced system settings, performance. Go down to custom and untick all all these except for show thumbnails instead of icons and smooth edges of um, screen fonts. I'm gonna hit apply. Okay. Okay. And back out. Now for the next step, type in system config. Configuration will pop up. Alright, there you go. Now you want to head over to boot, advanced options, and see the number of processors. You want to tick this and go to your highest one. So, well, what this will allow you to do is uh, it's going to allow your CPU to run at its best, like this maximum. So, I'm going to click 4 because that's my processor. It only can handle 4, so click OK. And for timeout, you want to put it to 5. But it, like if you have like a really good computer, you can put that put this down to one second. But I recommend five because you don't want to mess up anything in your computer. So we hit apply. Okay. And then you, well don't don't do this yet. So just exit without restarting. And now you can head over to CC Cleaner, and this is a program that you have to download. Head, head, head over to CC Cleaner after you download it, of course. You want to do a quick clean. So 
So what it's gonna do is gonna make sure clean all your computer for all the junk and stuff that was stored on it. I'm gonna let this process go through. Alright, so once it's done, all you gotta do is clean off. Alright, so now it's finished. So you you want to do this on a daily basis. So just to keep your computer running like fast. So after that, you, like, you can just exit. And last step, type in power. Go down to edit power plan. Power options. And here, you can click on high performance. You can unlock ultimate performance, but that's for higher end PCs. And I heard that ultimate performance basically just like high performance so it really doesn't matter just click high performance hit the X and restart your computer and your computer should be running fast as ever so now if you like this video hit that like and that subscribe button also comment down below what else videos you guys want to see me do on my channel and thank, thank you guys for 3k subscribers like that is like a milestone I was dreaming of hitting and we finally hit it so thank you guys so much and I love you guys to death and just thank you. Like this words can explain how thank much like how thankful I am. Just just thank you guys and until next until next guys peace out and yeah.